welcome to tangling along with me we are continuing on tanglepatterns.com and today it is this pattern that we're going to do this is um, actually great for a border I think um, but I'm not gonna use it as a border here um, I'm thinking of putting it in here actually I think I used this one uh, up here this triangle here um, so it's kind of starting with placing in some squares that you color in and I'm using my black micron PN for this and then you can make them in different sizes and thicknesses and you place some here and there kind of after each other so let's make a thicker one right here don't place them too close Oops. just taking my time and coloring in this shape and I'm going to make one that is kind of hidden here between this one a tangle over here like that okay so what you do is like you're going to fill in the space between the two uh, dark ones with new um, figures of these so you can make small ones and you can make thick ones just keep filling in with these Maybe you don't want the steps between them to be this big that I have it here. Or maybe you like them even bigger. So now I'm working my way up to this one. that I have up in this corner like that and you can start or end them with a string here if you want to but that's a pattern um, yeah that's all there is to it um, and now it's up to your um, shading to do something about it I'm just going to put a little graphite here along the side on a few of these and using my touchy young to make it into a shadow I'm not gonna do it on each of them but again I'm just picking out a few of them and placing shadow up the side here and that's actually all there is to it there we go um, I have this room over here I'm thinking of uh, taking my black micron and just making a line down here just like that um, and I'm going to take my white charcoal and I'm just going to lightly color in this room here don't push too hard on the paper or you will get lines in there that you can't get out with your tortillon then I'm just taking my tortillon and I am 
pushing the color into the paper here. And I get a unique uh, form color behind this shape. There we go. I like that a little bit. Or when I get a tangle over here, I might do the same on this side. Uh, but for now, I will leave it like that. So that was the tangle for today. It was this one. Um, not one of my favorite tangles, but maybe you could do something really cool with it. Um, very easy. So that was all for today. Thank you for watching. Have an attitude of gratitude.